Hi everyone, it's Lynn Smythe from The Creative Cottage. Today's gonna be a very short video. I'm going to be going over just seven pieces in my personal collection. Um, they're all by the same artist, Mary Watson. They're all sterling silver with semi-precious gemstones. And my cat is being real curious today. <laughs> so we'll see if I can complete this video or if I have to pause it. Now she just found a pair of copper earrings is waiting to add to a bundle. So um, when I started th this buying and selling of um, costume jewelry, you know, I also had the goal of to occasionally get some of these sterling silver and gemstone pieces. Um, I don't know if I'll ever get gold and diamond, like the real high quality stuff um, that's beyond my budget, unless there was a happy accident in any of my mixed jewelry lots. <laughs> so first, just a bit of housekeeping. Um, again, thank you for watching my channel. If you haven't already um, subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. And I think this bell is a notification button. So anytime I do a new video, you'll receive a no notification. Um, most of the stuff that I unbox in these videos or show in these videos is listed on my eBay site. But if there's anything you see in this video, uh, there's a chance I might not have listed it on eBay yet, in which case you can reach out to me, sales at thecreativecottage.net. Just let me know what video you watch, like the timestamp of the item, um, and a brief description, and we'll start the conversation from there. So let me get my cat off my desk. She's eating the cardboard box from the copper jewelry bundle I um, did the video on the other day. So these seven pieces, I believe I got them from goodwillfinds.com. That's a buy it now site, not an auction site. And I got it in two different orders, but it was from the same Goodwill. So I guess they had gotten like a donation of um, like an estate sale donation type of thing. Um, and they processed it in batches. Um, I just scooped it all up because it was uh, very affordable. And like I said, buy it now at affordable price sometimes beats doing the auctions because some of these auction prices are getting kind of crazy. So here's the first piece we're going to go over. It's a pair of earrings. It's garnet and picture jasper in sterling silver. Very nice. Kind of a peachy, pinky, corally color. And the garnets are kind of the deep red, almost a little purpley tinge. And real nice condition. Here's what the backs look like. She signs all of her pieces. So this one says, Mary, oops, it's going to focus. It says Mary Watson. And this piece says Sterling. And then it's etched with the date, 2019. I think all these pieces were made in 2018 or 2019. So um, rather modern, contemporary um, pieces. Like I said, in really, really good shape. Um, a lot of, uh, Mary sells at, uh, on her website, Silverstone Handcrafted. Um, a lot of these items are still available for sale. I think she does limited production after a while. She retires these designs. So if I lift them on eBay, um, I'm going to lift to like 50% of her suggested retail price, they're still a lot of money. So these on the, her website go for um, $260. <laughs> so if I were to sell them, I'd probably list them in the 130 range, including and shipping would be included. But on eBay, I'm always open to offers as long as you don't like really lowball me. Um, <laughs> so the, here's this first pair. I'm going to put it on this little earring rack. Remember, I got this um, acrylic earring rack from Fire Mountain Gems. I did a um, 
jewelry supply unboxing a few days back or a week or so ago. And the really cool thing about Mary Watson's pieces, they all kind of coordinate. So if you like one design, like you can buy a pendant and then you can save up to get earrings, a coordinating earrings at a later date. So that's those. This next piece is a pendant. It's Oh, goodness. I probably can't pronounce it. Some kind of fossil. Orthoceras. Probably butchered that. Fossil. And then, I, I can't tell if this is dyed bone. But she does these little carved faces on a lot of her pieces. And looking at all of them under my jewelry loop, they look really shiny. And some of them even looked crazed like this is ceramic or porcelain and the clear glaze is starting to craze but other information I got was that this is bone but I'm not entirely convinced so <laughs> if you know anything about Mary Watson's pizzas please let me know this is a beautiful piece um it includes this uh sterling silver neck chain and on her website um she sells it just the pendant without the neck chain for three hundred dollars so yeah that's crazy so i i would list it like at 150 and shipping would be included but again i'm open to reasonable offers so what do i have it upside down again this is upside down day so it's stamped mary watson sterling and then the date is etched in it can you see that 2018 so i'm thinking these pieces must have all come from the same household even though i got them in two different orders they're all etched with either 2018 and 2019 like i said they all kind of coordinate so um i would love to know who the original owner was they had great taste <laughs> Uh, let me see if I can show you the stamp on this. Ooh, it's so tiny. But, oh yeah, it's not focusing. That's It's stamped 925 right there. So this is a beautiful, I think it's about 22-inch silver chain. Um, you know, you could put something shorter on there. Here's the pendant bail. So you can take this chain off and put something else on if desired. I just think that's really, really neat. <laughs> Up my alley. And so that's number two out of seven. Then this next pair are garnet drops. And so you see how the garnet they would coordinate well with that type of thing. Well, I guess you can't, yeah, if you wanna wear two pairs of earrings, but um, I used to have double pierced ears. There, I'm trying to get the color, cause see, they are solid sterling on the back. So the color, yeah, there, the color's showing up in the garnets a little bit. Uh, let me see if I can find the stampings on here. Yeah, so it says, goodness, so it says it's etched 2019 there. Where did I put my jeweler's loop? Well, maybe that's all it is. It's 2019 on that earring, and then this one must have her. Yeah, do I have it upside down again? Yeah, Mary W. on that one. So these, I believe, brand new, full retail price, whoops, were in the $100 range. No, $200 range. Um, 
I would list these in the $100 range, shipping included, but again, open to negotiation. You know, I don't want to list them for too low because I think most sites people are expecting that you're going to negotiate a price, a lower price. So I have to leave some money on the table for myself or else I'll go bankrupt and I won't be able to make rent. <laughs> They'll have a wonderful jewelry collection. Mm. And so that was number three. Number four. Oh, we're going to do one of the pendant brooches. Look at this beauty. <laughs> I can't get the garment. Let's see. Oops. There we go. So it's garnet. And then see how shiny that is? To me, that looks like glass or porcelain or ceramic and it's this real sweet I call it a pendant brooch because on the back there's a pin and a pendant veil so you could wear it as a pin or you could put a nice sterling chain on there and wear it as a pendant and that's just I guess it's picture jasper I think that's what I'm calling all these stones I know what the garnet is but Everything else I'm calling picture jasper. <laughs> oh, and you see how it's signed in the back. Mary Watson, Sterling, and then the etching on the third line looks like 2019. So this one um, is not found under her pendant section on the Silverstone Handcrafted website. This She's got another heading or category named like wearable art and originally this would have like a stone base and I guess what that's what this little channel is to go into the stone base unfortunately the stone base I don't know where that is if it made its way to Goodwill whoever donated it or they didn't understand what it was maybe it was separated from the jewelry and that got thrown out so on um, her website, she lists these picture Jasper with garnet um, wearable art pieces for $380. Yes. So I would list it for $195, shipping included. But again, make me an offer. I just think that's really cool. And then you can see how, yay, how I'm making mess. See how this coordinates with all the other pieces? You could wear it with the little garnet drops or you could wear it with um, this set of picture Jasper with garnet earrings. Real cute. I want to wear it all, all at once. <laughs> so that was item 407. Then I don't want to do that one next week. Got two more pairs of earrings and a pendant to let go, I think. I've got them all wrapped up. This is anti-tarnish paper because this is sterling. I'm trying to protect it a little bit. I don't know how well anti-tarnish paper works, but we'll see. I got that from um, Fire Mountain Gems too. So this is a real cute little pair of earrings. These I could not find on her website. So I'm guesstimating based on the prices she's getting for everything else. She probably would have listed these in the 125 to 150 range. So I would list them for sale in the 60 to $75 range, shipping included, but make me an offer. But now these are much, well, they're shiny too. I was going to say they're a little dull. Maybe this is a bone, but I really can't tell. Um, looking at them under the loop, they're so shiny. It just looks like clear glaze on ceramic or, or glass, but again, I could be wrong. Can you polish bone to make it come out that shiny? Maybe. Uh, let's see for the markings. This one says Mary Watson Sterling. Let me see what the other one says. Oh, same thing. Mary Watson Sterling. Ooh, and that looks like a date. What is that, 2019? I think that's 20, it's it's in the top. 
So their name in uh, sterling, they're stamped into the metal, but the dates are etched. So it's a little bit fainter. It's not as deep as the stamped part. So again, see how she's using the same motif quite often. So, right, so you could wear these together as a set. Why aren't you focusing on the little one? So that would be cool. Or, like, you could wear these together. Awesome. Let me put these on the earring rack. And I have a couple other um, sterling silver and semi-precious gemstone pieces I was going to show in this video. I've got one Charles Arbor and one Whitney Kelly. But I decided, since I had seven pieces of Mary Watson, just to focus on Mary's pieces for this video. And maybe later on when I got more Charles Albert and more um, Whitney Kelly pieces, we'll do separate videos for them, too. So, one, two, three, four, five. That was number five. Two to go. One pair of earrings and one more pendant brooch. And here's the next pair of earrings. This is onyx on the bottom, black onyx. And the same bone or porcelain. Now these look more like bone, right? They look almost ivory or yellowish and they're duller. But the other ones are so super shiny. So I don't know if these are just dirty and need polishing. Um... Here's what the backs look like. Let's see if we can get the maker's mark. So that says sterling on that one. And Mary Watson on this one. Not sure if I see the date on this pair. Um, what was it on the other one? That might be it. Yeah, I think this is 2018 or 2019. So, let's see. These, I think, are still listed on her website for um, $220 for new, for brand new pair. So, since these are pre-owned, pre-loved, kind of estate sale type of thing, um... I would start them at 110, which would include shipping. But again, uh, you can make me an offer. And so you see how you could wear these together as a set. Or this looks really cool together because the black onyx and then this fossil stone. Oh, focus. Real cool. Let me put these on the earring rack real quick. And then we have one piece to go in this seven piece collection. It's another pendant brooch. And da, 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 here it is. Look at this one. Oh my God. I saw the picture of this. I was just like, oh, I love it. I want it. I must have it. <laughs> Um, but it's like the same stones that she's using in a lot of her other pieces. Tons of garnets in this one. A really cool, um, it's a little bit different. The other stones were like peachy, but this could be a picture of Jasper too, just more of a kind of bluey gray. Or am I just, I don't know what it is. I'm calling everything picture Jasper today, kind of day. <laughs> and then this same white, the porcelain ceramic bone glass not sure and this is what it looks like on the back again this is one of her wearable art collections this was meant to go into a stand that would have originally been occluded with this piece it's just like a stone a little um stone so it could stand up and you can enjoy it when you're not wearing it um 
So this was another one of the pieces listed on our website for 380. You know, I could start in the 190 range, shipping included, but make me an offer. And see how it has the pendant bail too, so you could attach a chain to it and wear it as a necklace. I'll show you the how it's signed, Mary Watson Sterling. And then you see the fainter etching 2019. So she's signing when these pieces are being made. And I guess uh, Mary and her husband um, used to do the shows. They used to travel around doing all the art shows. Um, I think they're getting older, so they're transitioning to all online sales. So she still has pieces listed for her website. I don't know if she's still making pieces, how long. And if so, how much longer she's going to be making pieces. So I have a feeling once she retires, which could be who knows when, that her prices, her pieces, the prices are going to skyrocket. Um, I was surprised she's not as well known as some of the other designers like Charles Albert, Amy Kahn, Russell, just to name a few, Whitney Kelly. I just um just love this her style her designs i don't know it just really floats my boat so um and again see how you well let me take the camera off Woo. so you could wear the garnet earrings with this piece you could wear the little Face wands. If you really want to get crazy, you could wear these because they have the garnet and the other color of picture jasper. Or even these with the onyx in the face. It's just all her pieces, I think, coordinate so well. And I love it. So let me know in the comments if you um, have heard of this designer, Mary Watson of Silverstone Handcrafted. If so, do you have you been collecting her pieces um and what do you know about these shiny white faces is it glass porcelain ceramic bone silly putty <laughs> i don't know yeah let's see these garnets how oh, are they and the garnets the little faces and the onyx and the faces. And then two pendants and the two pendant brooches. Awesome. So this is a short video, under half an hour. Woohoo! Um, I'll have links to my eBay site, social media sites, etc. Um, in the description box below this video. And um, look for the first comment. I'll pin it to the top if I... Um, you know, list these items, I'll put up links to the eBay listings or let you know if these pieces have sold. They're not, no longer available. So thank you so much for watching. Again, this is Lynn Smythe from The Creative Cottage. Bye.